let us start designing part 5 that is screw spindle drawing of the screw spindle is shown here the material used is FE410W take a look at the dimensions let us first draw a straight line of length 240 click on sketch front view draw a straight line of 240 mm pit screen here it is given 38 mm so take half of the value 19 mm here we should take half values along the vertical dimensions 19 mm now start drawing the rough profile of spindle Let us start dimensioning. This height is 11 mm. Distance here is 13 mm. Distance from here to here it is 83 mm. eighty three mm and here it is twenty two half of that we have taken eleven so it is given here it is given that ten into forty five that is this should be ten mm in length and angle should be forty five smart dimension mm you can take any of any either smart dimension or angle between here let us take here we are going to take smart dimension because it is not coming right take smart dimension drag and click on angle at the top and 45 degree length should be 10 mm that is why 10 into 45 here also 10 mm Distance between this is 65, so we have to take half of 65, 65 by 2. Revolve protrusion. Select the profile, OK. Select axis. Enter 360 degree. Finish. Here we see that there is a hole. So we have to make that hole. Go to sketch. Click on front view front plane draw a circle dimension of the circle is 12 mm through that means it has to pass from one side to other making a complete hole
एंटर ट्वेल्व एम डिस्टेंस फ्रॉम हियर टू हियर इट इज थर्टी फाइव एम एम रिटर्न कट आउट सेलेक्ट सेलेक्ट फ्रॉम स्केच सेलेक्ट द सर्कल ओके सिमेट्रिक ड्रैग एंटिल इट बिकम्स अ होल फिनिश नाउ हियर we done with the hole now we have to create a hole which is having internal threads the hole dia is m12 that is we have to make a hole of 12 mm length of thread is 30 mm and the length of hole is 35 mm for that we have to go to hole option Select the surface, hole table, threaded, here we need M12, that is 12 mm, diameter, enter the value here, select M12. Here we see that that is up to 30 mm only. And length of hole is 35 mm. So to find it extends enter here value 30 mm that is thread length. Wait. We are not given the length of hole. so go to last one finite l extent enter the value of hole that is 35 mm click on v bottom and uh, here it is see that measure is not from the tip of the v bottom so select the first one then click on okay Place it at the center. Click on return. Drag it down. So we have threaded hole here. Let's check that. Go to top. Here we can see that. Go back. next we have to produce thread on the cylinder and that is 38 into 7 for the length so go to thread okay click on the cylindrical surface where the thread is to be produced now we have to select the edge from where the threading should start select the surface now select the edge so we are selecting this edge because here it is shown that from this edge it is 3 mm so if we select that edge in particular we can 
start threading by giving the offset value otherwise if you select the other end we have to give the length of length to which a threading has to be done so give a offset value 3mm finish threading has been done now go to tools material material for screw spindle is fe410w type apply to model go to file file properties summary enter screw spindle go to project docu document number 5 screw spindle okay then open new file do save as part number 5 thank you now open new file